Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet. <laughs> Eating a curds and whey. Look in the spidey sat down beside. He said, hey, what's in the bowl, bitch? country's gonna feel me again. I'm gonna make you laugh. I don't look like it right now, but I'm gonna make you laugh. Look, this is the deal. In the late 80s, I became the biggest stand-up comic this world has ever seen. Madison Square Garden. Top of the world, man. I was everywhere. Television, movies. He is by far the funniest comic I've ever seen. Who brings their chicks to a dice show? and sits in the front row. I had gold and platinum albums. It was rock and roll comedy. Was that controversial? F yeah. No! I'll admit, sometimes I lose my cool. Why? I'm hard to deal with. I'm not angry. This is not mad, OK? This! This is mad! What? What? You start something you want, can't finish no. it? No, I don't want to get mad. You are already mad! All right, Andrew. Always a pleasure. Yeah, f you too. I get it. Make a long story short, my career went into the toilet. And years later, so did my marriage. So what did I do? Please, I'm trying to work here. I started filming my own life. Even though nobody asked me to. In a way, it's like therapy, you know what I mean? Oh. Sit close. I don't think I'm getting close, Andrew. Make like you're my date. I know, it's kind of creepy. I'm sick and tired of living in my own shadow. I, I want you to have dreams, but there's a difference between dreams and fantasies. With everything going on in the world, people are pissed off, just like they were in the late 80s. They need a comic hero. I feel like this is the moment. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to blow this whole thing up again. In New York, here we come. This is the biggest show that I've done in a I long know. time. It's really quite unbelievable what's happening. I'm gonna see if I could put myself back in those arenas and maybe even go further than that. This is an exciting day. Just came from the Howard Stern show and uh, we're gonna sell our book. I'm gonna see just how big I could become again. This was great, okay? This is why I came back east to feel the crowd. This feels like 20 years ago when things were really starting to take off. It's been 10 years since I've done my stand-up on television. I promise it's gonna be huge. Dice back on TV. It's about time. You are still a highly recognizable person. Yeah. It looks like a soprano. You know, I'm known as a pretty good looking guy. You ever feel so stressed out you just gotta get out of town? We got a problem. Look, I love you. If the guy is not ready to record, I am not going on the stage. I mean, just every step of the way is like walking on hot coals. With all due respect, you have a lot of work to change everybody's mind so that you actually mean something and that you're still funny. If I fail, the only one that fails is me. And I'll wind up 70 years old in f***ing comedy clubs where people come and pay a few bucks to see what used to be a legendary comic. I can't let that happen. The